All that ahead, but first here at 6, breaking news at Midway Airport. Chopper 2 showing crews investigating a plane that was forced to land. That plane has the United States of America written on it. CBS 2's Chris Habermel is in Chopper 2. Chris. Well, as you notice, that's not just any aircraft. That's uh, part of uh, the fleet that flies out of Joint Base Andrews in Maryland, and that supports government missions worldwide here. And, you notice that it's painted blue and white, kind of like Air Force One. And so that aircraft, which was in Chicago for some reason, was uh, at Midway, had departed from Midway, ran into some sort of an issue, and had to return to the airport. Now, the first word we've been hearing is that uh, it may have been a bird strike. It hit uh, some sort of a bird in flight, so that would explain why uh, air crewmen had come out immediately after that aircraft taxied into parking. And also ramp personnel were looking at the leading edges of the port side wing, or the left wing, and also the nose around the ray dome there. So nobody was hurt. The aircraft's in parking. It's going to be looked over, maybe taken out of service, depending on what kind of damage may have been done. We're still working on this developing story. Reporting live over Midway, Chris Haberville, CBS 2 News. All right. Chris, thank you.